Phoenix Police Chief Jerry Williams, with only weeks before her retirement, faces new allegations that she undermined public trust in law enforcement and tried to hide the truth from the public. Yeah, the ABC 15 investigators broke the story about Chief Williams' use of a secret messaging app called Signal on the job. Now, investigator Melissa Blasius reports on the call for a new probe that could affect future court cases involving Phoenix police. This letter sent to Phoenix's city manager and obtained by ABC 15 has screenshots from a just the top messaging group indicating Phoenix Police Chief Jerry Williams may still have been using the Signal secret messaging app with its disappearing messages until at least 2021 after a police spokesperson had previously said that Chief Williams asked that Signal not be used by her executive team for work-related issues and deleted her app from her phone in 2020. Because it undermines public trust. Mark Spencer's with Judicial Watch, a conservative group that calls for government transparency. He's also a retired Phoenix Police Union leader. Over the weekend, Spencer sent this letter to the Maricopa County Attorney's Office asking for a review of Chief Williams' conduct and other Phoenix Police managers if they utilize the signal app. Maricopa County attorneys can evaluate what's going on with the management misconduct and the allegations and whether they deem it is uh, appropriate to put them on the Brady list, a Rule 15 issue. Brady lists are kept by prosecutors to track officers with a history of dishonesty, criminal activity, and other integrity issues. And Brady list information can be used to challenge an officer's credibility on the witness stand. Public officials have to comply with public records law. This runs afoul of that. That's called a destruction of evidence. That could be a public records law violation or even tampering with evidence. I expect a little more of a police chief, and I'm sure taxpayers do too. The Phoenix Law Enforcement Association, representing rank and file officers, also weighing in with this statement. We believe all police officers, regardless of rank, should be held to the same standard of conduct, especially when it involves providing accurate information to the public. Our priority is preserving the integrity of the Phoenix Police Department. Therefore, leadership must be transparent and truthful when questioned about serious allegations. The Maricopa County Attorney's Office says it did receive the Judicial Watch letter and it's under review, but would not comment further. I'm investigator Melissa Blasius, ABC 15, Arizona. We reached out to the city manager's office with a number of questions. Amongst other things, we wanted to know if they plan to investigate Chief Williams for potential violations of public records law. We also asked if the city manager's office used Signal or other messaging apps to communicate about city business. Now, in response, a city spokesperson emailed this statement. Tech, uh, technological changes have influenced the way people communicate in modern society. Those changes often outpace policies and procedures regulating their use. The city is committed to an evaluation of our policies and training to ensure employee adherence to all applicable, applicable public records law.